And the Tony goes to Alex Newell's it is Alex Newell's world, and we're all living in it. The Lynn native took home the Tony for Best Actor in a Musical at last night's award ceremony. Newell's win as a non-binary performer is a first for the Tonys. And WBZ's Brandon Truitt spoke with people who used to share the stage with them and applauding this history-making achievement. I watched the entire evening with like a lump in my throat. Julie Menard heads up the Marblehead Little Theater. It's where she first met Alex Newell for auditions in 2009. They just opened their mouth and started singing um, and all of us just kind of looked at each other like should we go home? The star power was evident from the beginning. Newell grew up in Lynn and worked their way up through the local theater scene. What's it like performing next to Alex? It is inspiring but Alex is also incredibly humble Independently owned and complicated. those unbelievable vocals and their role in shucked on Broadway won Newell best actor in a musical at Sunday's Tony Awards Newell's mother was their guest and mommy I love you thank you for believing in me thank you for loving me unconditionally thank you for teaching me what strength is Newell's win marks the first time a non-binary person has won the acting category. Newell does not identify as a man or woman. That struggle of defying the odds, a theme in their acceptance speech. I should not be up here as a queer, non-binary, fat, black, little baby from Massachusetts. And to anyone that thinks that they can't do it, I'm going to look you dead in your face that you can do anything you put your mind to. A historic win for a one-of-a-kind voice, paving the way for those behind them. In Boston, Brandon Truitt, WBZ News. Wow.